Welcome back. I guess you've mastered versions 1 and 2 of Lewis Collins. You're ready to move on? Let's do it. So, coming out of version 1, you've got this. But now we're going to play... So what I'm doing there, I'm just starting with my G chord and I'm playing, I'm pinching these, I grab the fourth string which is open with a thumb, come back, grab the sixth string again, and then, be, and then when I hit the fourth string the next time I'm going to slide the entire G chord up so I can grab on the first string the fifth fret while I pinch on the fourth string open. So it looks like this. And I can come right back, pinch the first and sixth, fourth open, and then I make a G7. We play that. Let's do it together. One, two, ready, go. Nice. All right, so now we're going to play our C chord with the fifth string, remembering what the thumb is doing, keeping that rocking back and forth, driving along. So what I do is I'm playing open on the first string, one, two, three, and then on the four I pinch it open again, and then, and then put my pinky down on the third fret on the first string of my C chord. Then you repeat all of that, one, two, three. Four, one, two, three, four. That's the only change. So let's play from the beginning through all of that. One, two, ready, go. This time our G, we're grabbing on the second string on the third fret, and then open on the top string, and then just like version two, add another one there. Let's play the whole thing, version three. One, two, ready. Go. So get some traction out of version 3. Don't just jump right into version 4. This is an acceptable piece, uh, just, just performing on version 3. totally do 
that. Miss Collins weeped. Miss Collins moaned to see her son Lewis leaving home. The angels laid him away. You can totally do that. Get really comfortable with this and have that down before you move on to version 4. We'll just end the video here and then we'll have a separate video for version 4.